for George. <laughs> and, uh, we are the aptly named Mike and Chris. Um, Match. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're the distaff counterparts of each other. <laughs> You'll tell me that word means after. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell them it means lady. Uh, 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 we'd like to do some improv for you guys, but uh, in order to get started, uh, we need you guys to ask us a question that you would like us to answer, uh, like a real question about us. Did you plan your outfits? <laughs> <laughs> That's easy. No, uh, we did not. Uh, however, uh, most of my clothes uh, are this shirt. <laughs> 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 I've been uh, slowly trying to uh, like eliminate things that I own, uh, starting with things that go on my body. Uh, if, it this, if it weren't this shirt, uh, it would be another shirt that's very similar. To uh, I was just thinking, I, I think of all the times that we've done improv together, I'm pretty sure I've seen this shirt on you 95% of the time. And then a pair of shoes 100%. Yeah. <laughs> Almost without doubt. In fact, there was a picture that got circulated around on Facebook recently of us back when we did a show back in like 2011, and I think you were wearing this shirt. <laughs> ah, <laughs> no, different shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Same, similar yeah. tartan, different shirt. Yeah, but I really know tartan after the show. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> but I really know what I like. <laughs> this, show, this shirt is probably, how long have you had that shirt, Chris? Uh, I got this shirt last summer. Yeah. No, really, that's not the answer I thought. <laughs> I thought it would be much more recent. The, uh, the last summer? No, I, I do, I distinctly know I had it at least last year because I wore it to a bachelor party last October and the groom threw up on me. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> and on this shirt, and I had to like fly back with it. Um, so I had to like wrap it up, all kinds of weird to keep the vomit inside. Uh. The shirt. Uh. <laughs> it's a bachelor party. <laughs> uh, so anyway, no, we did not plan this. <laughs> Good 
show tonight. What? Good show, Carol. Good show. Thank you. <laughs> Good show for you as well. <laughs> Good night to go out on. Mm -hmm. good, good audience, good crowd. Mm -hmm. Good show, Carol. Yes, you said that already. <laughs> never say it now. One of these days we'll be on our deathbeds, and we won't remember the days when we weren't on them. You may not remember. <laughs> you may not remember. I will remember. I'm the one with my mind like a steel trap. I still remember the lines of the first play we ever did together. Hello, my name, my name is Duke Gregory. Would you like to buy a hot dog? <laughs> <laughs> I nailed that hot dog line. <laughs> Much confidence, and I was just a teenager. <laughs> ah, yes, the poster from the show. <laughs> I keep it in the show. <laughs> 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 You trimmed the poster? <laughs> yes. Couldn't stand for that 30 by 40 anymore. It was too big. Ostentatious. <laughs> <laughs> Your taste has always been impeccable. <laughs> you know what? I'm just going to leave it. You look fine. I don't know why I even need to look better than that these days. No more, sh no more shows. Pish posh. Not pish posh me. Pish posh you. Pish posh me. Pish posh you. You left the picture. Your fake eyelashes are still on. Girl. What will you do without me? What will you do without me? I guess I'll just walk around with fake eyelashes. <laughs> And I'll bat my eyes at all those young stage boys backstage. Mm -hmm. Please. Pow, please. <laughs> I've been with many women. Good for you. <laughs> I wasn't dumb. And most of the women I've been with would know exactly when they had fake eyelashes on and when they didn't. I'd heard that a bar. Just fake eyelashes? Or whim? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to miss you. <laughs> now you're talking like you're going somewhere. We've got four more shows this weekend, including three on Sunday. You didn't hear? Didn't hear what? This was my life. Performance. Your last performance? For the weekend? <laughs> yes. <laughs> but for the run. For my career. What? You can't retire. You're younger than I am. I haven't retired. Oh, but I'm not you. You have a heart like a locomotive cap. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. It is fueled by coal. <laughs> oh, yeah. Don't say that about you. No, it's true. No, it's not. Look, at a certain point, you have to look back on six failed marriages and wonder what's the common factor? What's the common denominator? Me. No, I was the wrong man, Carol. That's the common six factor. Six times? <laughs> oh, and my fiance, Pablo. Look at him. <laughs> I don't want to look at him. Look at him. I don't want to. Why not? Because he will be number seven. I know he will. <laughs> I know he will. The whole thing will fall apart. It'll be my fault and I'll be right back here again. Carol, you don't need to act. This is a dressing room. <laughs> Just because. Let's be honest with one another. Fine. 
I stand here before you as a half shoot. You're not standing! <laughs> I'm sorry, but you're a half shell of a man. I'm a naked man. <laughs> How come you never put a move on me? <laughs> oh, didn't I? <laughs> Uh, Name for me five examples. <laughs> <laughs> you made moves on me. And here, Nixon. Careful. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hi, hi. So uh, I couldn't help but notice uh, you were walking by this cafe that you do every Thursday, mm -hmm. and I <laughs> happened to reserve <laughs> <ten> <laughs> <Carol. laughs> Oh, Carol, have I been waiting for this day? And I'm already in chaos! <laughs> I wish the boss would show up. If he were to come in here and see what you were doing, he would reprimand you and give you a slap on the face. Ah, yes, but my love, Lady Lagunia, now we must kiss! That's not in <laughs> <laughs> Who's the son? 
Is this blatant uh, enough for you? I'm the son. But you would be number seven. I would ruin your life. Oh, just you as would. I ruined. <laughs> <laughs> no, I believe I can really go. <laughs> you believe you can what? I believe I can be the man. But you're leaving the theater. My life is the theater. I could be persuaded to return. <laughs> really? Mm -hmm. We can we could do the, another presentation of our town. Yes, our town. <laughs> yes, our town. Mm -hmm. Finally, get around to doing that that adaptation of The Tempest, where it takes place in 1972 New York. <laughs> <laughs> and we all begin as butterflies. <laughs> oh yes. And we can finally do that improv show we have been talking about. Oh, how one's dreams manifest in the most peculiar way. <laughs> Carol, kiss me. Really? Yes. Where? Just right here at my butchers. <laughs> are these your smooches? Are these them? They are. I've kissed you so many times on stage, but never once not when there are thousands and thousands of yes. people watching. It's more intimate, more private. <laughs> I don't know if I can do it. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, sorry. I'm so sorry, Carol. I should have thrown Oh, uh, no! Wait! I'll take them out. I'll take my show teeth out and put my street teeth back in. <laughs> Just let me exchange out my show teeth. Carol, I'm around. afraid that this will be a memory that I take to the grave. A memory? <laughs> and did you say a memory? No, a memory. Oh, it sounded like you sort of elided the last syllable there. <laughs> I would elight nothing with you, you know that. No, not elight, elide. No, I would elide nothing. I would elide nothing. After the show, tell me that. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I'm sorry. No, I've given you enough chances over the years, Carol. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> no, if it hasn't happened all these years. <laughs> No, Carol, no need to insert your street teeth. <laughs> no, look at me, I'm like a normal now. Uh. <laughs> oh, wait, let me take out my show eyeball. <laughs> I, quite, I quite prefer it in. <laughs> show eyeball? Yes. Have you seen my sex eyeball? <laughs> <laughs> no, Carol, no, no. Carol, no, what, what will my wife think, Carol? Ten minutes ago, what? Ten minutes ago, I never wanted you, but now all of a sudden I want you more than anything that I've ever wanted in my entire life, including that fifth Tony. And I don't mean the statue. <laughs> Strange, your first five husbands were all named Tony. <laughs> what can I say? I've got a tight. No, Carol, no! <laughs> Carol, no! You pressed my breast. <laughs> oh, was that your stage breast? <laughs> no, this is the staging. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Carol. Look, I, I can't help but believe. Um. <laughs> from the stage adaptation of Top Gun. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, be my wingman! Come <laughs> straighter to a flyby! <laughs> I'm coming for you! No, I, I won't go into it. No, no, no. no. the thing is, Carol, why m must I ask you? It's been so long. And why now? Why Why on the day that I'm walking out the door you change your tune? It's <laughs> so dramatic now. Stop always. putting your hands on my naked body. <laughs> <laughs> you can put them on the towel as I have. <laughs> Don't put on the towel. No. Put on my robe. The robe I got from Amy Allen. 
Singer-songwriter. <laughs> 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 ghostwriter for Ace of Base. But <laughs> <laughs> I remember her well. <laughs> she did well in those adaptations of the songs for our musical version of National Treasure 2. <laughs> 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 Yes, it is I, it is Abe, it is I, it is Abe, it is I, it is A, it is Abe, it is I, it is Abe, it is I, it is I, it is A. The Declaration of Independence is where you should be. The Declaration of Independence is not a book. The Declaration of Independence holds a lot of secrets. The Declaration of Independence is inside my page. <laughs> You were such a good Abraham. <laughs> you were such a good Nick Cage. <laughs> and also Justin Bartha. Yes. <laughs> it, was only, it was only a two-person two person show. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh, it will stay in my shower as a memory. <laughs> Perhaps this is for the best. We part ways as friends, as comrades, as professionals. We can always have the memory of what could have been. Yes. Mm -hmm. We'll always, mm -hmm. we'll always remember how it was when we raced. We'll remember cats. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and its sequel, Cats Two Three Lines. <laughs> and that sequel, Cats. <laughs> Catchup. <laughs> and that sequel. Ketchup, <laughs> which got paired with a matinee of mustard. <laughs> mustard and ketchup, <laughs> together forever. Girl, embrace me. Okay. okay. Mm. Oh, don't do the weird pat thing. <laughs> Just hold me. I'll stay for three more shows. Okay. okay. Wait, four? How many? Four more. I'll stay for the rest of them. Great. Would you like to? <laughs> I would. Let me take off my show wig. <laughs> <laughs>